Right, so I'm sure a few of you have probably seen one of these. This is a low pressure sodium lamp and unfortunately this one, as you can probably see by the extra little bit of shininess there and there, the uh, inner tube has broken causing molten sodium, well actually more accurately vaporised sodium, to leak and coat the inside of the glass. So we're going to put a thousand volts or so through this just to see what happens really. I'll put a little overlay on the thing now to show you what it does when you try and power it up normally. Not great. So let's blow this up and then of course we'll smash it and play with the sodium. But... Right, let's see what happens. But it's not happy. Neither of the transformers. Socks land. That rattling is literally just coming from the transformers moving. I might try and stop that because that is really annoying. Much better. I don't think it's very happy. What's probably going to happen is something will melt, the glass will melt, and then the vacuum will go. Sounds like that's about to happen, doesn't it? Does not look happy. Oh wow, look at that. Oh. oh. That's it. It's done. There it goes. Because the vacuum failed on the outer envelope and air got in. And that's the end of that. Right, here's the lamp, and this is how you're supposed to dispose of them. Lovely. How satisfying was that? I have to admit. Right, now all you've got to do is spray a bit of water on it. Get all that sodium reacted. I think that's all of it. There we go. Done. Right then, now all we need to do is dispose of this like we would any normal glass. You can see the reflective tin oxide coating on there. Uh, there's one of the emitters, look. Actually, it's probably a good idea to get a nice picture of the emitters. There we go. Now. 
And that's what one of the emitters looks like. This is actually a lot more solid than I thought it would be. That is quite strong, quite strong metal. There we go. Oh, there's the little mica covers. There's the getter look. I'm guessing that's the getter, yeah, that's the getter. See the big tube. Lovely, there we go.